You're bouncy, trouncy, flouncy, pouncy, fun, 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 fun. Uh, but the most wonderful thing about tickers is I'm the only one. I'm the only one. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 greatest songs from old and classic Disney movies. For this list, we'll be looking at the best tracks featured in Disney films that were released pre-Renaissance, meaning before 1989. We're excluding tunes from live-action flicks, though, as those deserve their own list. Which classic Disney song makes your dreams come true? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. All in the Golden Afternoon, Alice in Wonderland. We shall sing Golden Afternoon. That's about all of us. As far as Disney flicks go, Alice in Wonderland is one of the wonderfully quirkiest. Naturally, its musical stylings reflect that. In a World of My Own provides a glimpse into Alice's imagination before her adventure even really begins. In a world of my own, all the flowers would have very extra special powers. And who could forget the white rabbit's I'm late? I'm late, I'm late, for a very important date. No time to say hello, goodbye, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late. But no number gets us humming more than all in the golden afternoon. Sung primarily by the flowers of Wonderland, it's as melodic a tune as they come. The instrumentation is irresistible, while the chorus of voices is nothing short of gorgeous. Even Alice can't help but join in. You can learn a lot of things from Who knew flowers could sound so good? We can learn a lot of things from them, indeed. Number 9. Everybody Wants to Be a Cat – The Aristocats First, we have to thank the Aristocats for reminding us how important our scales and arpeggios are. Bring the music ringing from your chest and not your nose While you sing your scales and your arpeggios But as catchy as that tune is, nothing quite compares to Everybody Wants to Be a Cat. We've been hooked on that snazzy feline beat since we first heard it. And you won't hear us complaining about it. Oh, a rinky dinky dinky! Everybody wants to be a cat! Thomas O'Malley, Scat Cat and company go all out for this one. And it's a party. There's offensive elements, and they can't be excused. But if you cut those out, there's lots to enjoy. Even if you're not the biggest cat person around, there's no denying this song has style. After all, a cat's the only cat who knows where it's at. Everybody! Everybody! Everybody wants to be a cat! Number 8. Why Should I Worry? Oliver and Company. One minute I'm in Central Park. Then I'm down on the Street. What do you get when you combine an animal, New York City based reimagining of Oliver Twist, and the talents of one Billy Joel? The answer is a banger, of course. The 1988 flick sees Joel as Dodger, a dog who's cooler than cool. And he really gets our attention with Why Should I Worry. He's so self-assured in his delivery, and the dynamic energy running through his vocals and the beat itself is infectious. Plus, while spotlighting his chill persona, the song makes those of us listening forget our own worries for a while, too. By the end, there's zero doubt in our minds that Dodger is street smart with New York City heart and oodles of street savoir faire. Number 7. Baby Mine – Dumbo There are some songs that make you tear up the second they start playing. Baby Mine is without question one of them. We can't stand seeing Mrs. Jumbo locked up. Yet when her struggling son Dumbo comes to visit her, she focuses all her attention on him while we hear this hauntingly beautiful lullaby. She's putting her own pain aside to comfort her little one, and it never fails to tug at our heartstrings. Mother and child find solace in each other, and we too find solace in the unconditional love that seeps through the ballad. Let those eyes sparkle and shine, never a tear, baby of mine. 
Plus, the way Betty Noyes' gorgeous voice takes over the scene is like the biggest hug. We'd even say it's precious to us. You are so precious to me. Cute as can be, baby of mine, baby mine. Number 6. Hi-Ho! Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs Luckily for us, Disney's very first animated feature film doesn't skimp on the music. Just whistle while you work And cheerfully together we can tidy up the place Snow White has us whistling while we work, and listening attentively as she sings about love in truly beautiful fashion. But we'd like to take this opportunity to focus on Doc, Grumpy, and the rest of the crew, because they deliver one of the catchiest tunes we know. In the movie, they sing about doing their thing in the mines, going home after a long day, and later even heading off to work. <gasps> oh, go on, run along! Hi-ho, hi-ho, it's off to work we go! and we always find ourselves jamming like nobody's watching. As a bonus, Hi-Ho doubles as the perfect anthem to blast at your own job, be it quitting or starting time. Hi-Ho, Hi-Ho, it's home from work we go. Hi-Ho, 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 Hi-Ho. Number 5. Cruella de Vil, 101 Dalmatians. If she doesn't scare you, no evil thing will. Cruella de Vil is one of the most preposterous Disney villains out there. Seriously, who goes after pups? Cruella de Vil, Cruella de Vil. If she doesn't scare you, no evil thing will. So it's only right that there be a tune that captures exactly how vile she is. The one Roger Ratcliffe comes up with is as fun and clever as she is horrible. The punchy melody and lyrics combine, giving us chills while also inspiring some laughs. At first you think Cruella is a devil, but after time has worn away the shock. The fact that Roger initially performs it as Cruella is arriving at the Ratcliffe residence, before we learn the extent of her cruelty, just adds to the impact. After she leaves, we can't join him in singing fast enough. We totally get why the track becomes super popular by the movie's end. Seen her kind of watching you from underneath the rock. Cruella de Vil, Cruella de Number 4. Once Upon a Dream, Sleeping Beauty The notion that you could come across someone and feel as though you know them from your dreams is deeply romantic. Once Upon a Dream brings that heavenly sense to life musically, making for an enchanting listening experience. Indeed, the ballad is so rich, and the lyrics about a gleam in one's eyes and visions fill our hearts with love and wonder. We never tire of watching Aurora and Prince Philip duet it, or dance as a chorus vocalizes off-screen. Granted, their woodsy encounter isn't their first meeting, but she was a baby the other time, so it may as well be. We couldn't think of a better song to accompany such a momentous occasion, or to open and close out the movie. Number 3. The Bear Necessities, The Jungle Book Have you ever wondered what being a bear might be like? Whether your answer to that question is yes or no, you'll surely love hearing the answer laid out in The Bear Necessities. They'll come to you. Look for the bear necessities, the simple bear necessities. Forget about your worries and your strife. With his snazzy rendition, Baloo reminds us that we need to forget about our worries and our strife, because the bare necessities of life will come to us. And we love when Mowgli eventually lends his voice to the performance and adopts the philosophy, too. Look for the bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Forget about your worries and your strife. The whole thing is an upbeat, energetic, easygoing banger. We just wish it lasted longer. Thankfully, there are plenty of other tracks from the 
Jungle Book to keep us entertained once this one ends. And be just like the other men. I'm tired, I'm walking around. Oh, ooby doo. I want to be like you. Trust in us, it's a stellar soundtrack. Trust in me. Just in me. Number two, a dream is a wish your heart makes, Cinderella. Disney flicks have a magical ability to make us believe that no matter how our hearts are grieving, things will get better if we keep on believing in our dreams. That's exactly what Cinderella accomplishes with a dream is a wish your heart makes. No matter how your heart is grieving, if you keep on As she sings about the importance of keeping the faith early on in the film, we feel like she's speaking straight to us, and that's saying nothing of Eileen Woods' delivery, which is downright breathtaking. The dream that you wish will come true. The way the fairy tale plays out only bolsters the gentle tune's uplifting message, cementing it as an all-time classic. Since we're talking about Cinderella, though, allow us to also shout out the fairy godmother, who gives us a bibbity bobbity bop. Put them together and what have you got? Bibbity bobbity boop. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Bella Notte, Lady and the Tramp, the perfect Disney date night tune. It's a beautiful night, and we call it a Bella Notte. You can fly, Peter Pan. Listening to this feels like flying. Think of all the joy you'll find when you leave the world behind. And bid your cares goodbye. You can fly, you can fly, you can fly, you can fly, you can fly. Oodalali, Robin Hood. Golly, what a snappy number. Danger in the water, they were drinking, they just guzzled it down. Never dreaming that a scheming sheriff and his posse was a watching them and gathering around. Someone's waiting for you, the rescuers. Heartbreaking in the most poignant way. Hold your head up, though no one is near. Someone's waiting for you. The world's greatest criminal mind, The Great Mouse Detective. Oh, Radigan, you terrify us with this song. But now that I'm at it again, an even grimmer plot has been simmering in my great criminal brain. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. When You Wish Upon a Star – Pinocchio Get yourself a conscience that can guide you through life and croon out one of the most inspirational film songs around. Jiminy Cricket has range first showing off his endless musical talent with When You Wish Upon a Star. We aren't exaggerating when we say Cliff Edwards' commanding voice stops us dead in our tracks. When you wish upon a star as dreamers do. Of course, there's also Ned Washington's lyrics and Lee Harline's music, which warm our hearts. It all blends seamlessly, creating an enduring masterpiece. Now, Pinocchio is filled with captivating numbers like I've Got No Strings. I got no strings to hold me down, to make me fret or make me frown. I hit strings, but now I'm free. There are no strings on me. But nothing quite compares to the fuzzy feeling we get when we hear Jiminy assure us that when we wish upon a star, our dreams come true. And sees you through when you wish upon a star. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.